Hello everybody, my name is Mohit Despande, and in this course we'll be building an app that can track objects through video and actually determine what their speed is based on certain properties of our camera. So we'll be able to build this, and I've shown this visualization uh, here. You can see that I have a pencil here that I'm waving, and there are points that are being tracked on that pencil, and we can get these speed readings uh, from those points. And so that's what we're going to be building in uh, in this course, and you can try this out with other objects as well. So kind of the big topic that we're going to be discussing is uh, called optical flow, and optical flow allows us to take points in video and track them through uh, each frame. So we're going to discuss how that kind of works, uh, and we're also going to talk a little bit about camera intrinsics because we have to know a little bit more about our own cameras before we can get accurate uh, speed measurements. And kind of lastly, I'm going to show you how we can visualize these optical flow patterns. And what I mean by that is, and you saw in the previous slide how I can kind of draw on top of uh, draw on top of my frames, and we can kind of draw a path. So we've been making video courses since 2012, and we're super excited to have you on board. Online courses are a great way to you know, learn new skills, and I take a lot of these courses myself. So Zemo courses consist mainly of video lessons, and you can watch, rewatch them as many times as you want, and at your own pace. Everything we do in source code uh, is downloadable, by the way. And uh, with with when we're when I'm coding this stuff uh, in the videos, I really, really recommend that you code along uh, with me because the coding along helps you uh, more learn the material better than just watching. Uh, code. So, and the kind of last thing that I want to mention is that students who get the most out of these online courses are the same students that kind of make a weekly plan or a schedule and stick with it based on your own availability and whatever your learning style is. And remember that these videos, you can watch and rewatch them as many times as you want. So that kind of gives you a, a lot of flexibility. So at Zenvo, we've taught programming and game development to over 200,000 students, over 50 plus courses since 2012. And a lot of these students have used the skills that they've learned in these courses to advance their own careers. Uh, some have started companies and published their own uh, games and apps. So thanks for joining, and I look forward to seeing the cool stuff you'll be building. But now, without further ado, let's get started.